worries about it when you when you talk about stature but he is very 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 strong you know and we can see it John Fisher and Derek Cochimilio of, uh, of both oh and we got a bit of, uh, of an issue at the finish line here where there's a fight going on this is the first time I've seen this happening and it for the next one another big one you have Kyle Croxall in this one Derek Cochimilio this could be the breakout moment for him Kyle Croxall right there He's a big man, as we've been saying all day long. Great skater, really solid glider. Derek Cochimilio, he fits into that framework as well. And look at this, we've got Riders ready. Fabian Mel's in there. The smallest guy oh, is John Fisher. Well, Fisher right there in the pink. I mean, Fisher led the entire race in the, in the round of 32 to get here into the quarterfinals. So he's a big threat now. Well, look at him, he takes oh, an early lead. Oh. Oh my goodness, and uh, Fabian Mels gets tangled up with Kyle Croxall. Derek Cochimilio once again playing the smart game. This is also a tactic. Watch what happens in front of you and then pay attention and try and stay away from any drama. And Derek Cochimilio has done just that. He is doing a great job with John Fisher. Both of these guys potentially eliminating a couple of very strong competitors in Kyle Croxall and Fabian Mels. Canada one, two, three right now. Yeah, and here comes here comes Fabian Mels and Kyle Croxall well in the back there. Kyle Croxall in third place, Fabian Mels way, way, way back. But at this point right now, it's all about John Fisher and Derek Cochimilio trying to stay on their feet to the finish line. I tell you what, John Fisher uh, pull off a big upset tonight. Hey. You know, he's won two heats in a row. The kid's clearly in shape. It's he's under review. He's well, absolutely in shape. But John Fisher, you know, he's the smallest guy in that group. There's no two ways about it when you when you talk about stature. But he is very, very, very strong. You know, and we can see it. John Fisher and Derek Com Cochimilio of, uh, of both. Oh, and we got a bit of, uh, of an issue at the finish line here where there's a fight going on. This is the first time I've seen this happening. And it's Kyle Croxall who obviously thought Fabian Mels was uh, playing a dirty game up top. So we're going to have to keep a close eye on this. Well, either way, that doesn't go over too well. It's not, not under all. review, by the way. So Mels obviously disturbed.